Hello guys. Welcome to back to our channel. In today's video, I am going to show you how to fix Call of Duty Warzone Dev Error 6068 on Windows 10 and 11. Below find out the solutions that we are trying in this video to solve the error. If you are also the one seeing the dreaded Dev Era 6068 while playing or launching the Call of Duty Modern Warfare game, then this video is for you. Here we will show you several different effective solutions that works for you to fix the error and start playing the game. But before starting, please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Also ring the bell to get notified when the next video lands. Fix 1, Run Game as Administrator. Call of Duty game requires admin privileges to run smoothly, so very first make sure to launch Call of Duty with admin privileges. Open Battle. Net Launcher and then open the Call of Duty window. Now click on the Options tab and select the Show and Explorer option. Right click on the Call of Duty file, with EXE extension, in the Call of Duty folder. And from the menu, select Run as Administrator. Fix 2. Set the Call of Duty process priority to high. The Call of Duty games loads of the GPU and CPU quite heavily, so changing priority of the game process to high fix the error for many gamers. Open the Task Manager. Here finds the Call of Duty process, and right-click on it. Then choose Go to Details. Then in the Details tab, right-click on the Call of Duty. Hover your mouse to the Set Priority option and click on the High. Now launch the game to see if the error is resolved. Fix 3. Reinstall DirectX. If the DirectX gets corrupted it create issue when running any application or games. So reinstalling the DirectX may works for you. Visit the website. Click on the download button and follow the on-screen instructions to download the DirectX End User Runtime Web Installer. Once the downloading is completed, navigate to the folder where you saved it and run the executable file. Follow the on-screen instructions, then unpack the DirectX End User Runtime Web Installer's files and keep all the files in the directory of your choice. Go to the folder where you have unpacked the DirectX End User Runtime Web Installer's files and find a file named zip. exe, then double-click on it to run the exe file. Now, follow on-screen instructions to reinstall the DirectX on your computer. Fix 4. Deactivate NVIDIA Overlay Programs like AMD Overlay, NVIDIA GeForce Experience, Discord Overlay, and game bar can cause error with the COD Modern Warfare. So disabling with may works for you. First exit the Call of Duty game, from the task manager to kill all the COD processes. Then launch the NVIDIA GeForce experience. And click on the General tab. Then go to the in-game overlay and press the toggle button to switch it off. Save the changes and close the GeForce experience. Fix 5, Disable Game Bar. Now try disabling the Game Bar settings and to do so exit the game completely. Go to the Windows search box, and type the Game Bar. Click on the Game Bar settings. In the Game Bar settings window, press the toggle button to switch the Game Bar off. Now, relaunch the Call of Duty and check if the error is fixed or not. Fix 6. Change Value of Video Memory Scale The Call of Duty is a high graphics game, and when it loads the VRAM heavily, it chokes it, which cause several issues. So, lowering video memory scale settings may fix the error. Exit from the COD and close all of its associated processes in the Task Manager. Now open the File Explorer, and navigate to the location, documents backslash call of duty modern warfare backslash players here search for the adverb underscore options any file and open it with the notepad find this line video memory scale 
change the value of video memory scale to the 0.5. So, these are the solutions that I hope works for you. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Also let us know in the comment box which solutions works for you or you can also share your queries. If you want to watch more such useful videos, then don't forget to subscribe to our channel and stay tuned with us. Thanks for watching.